Welcome back, adventurers. Today we begin episode 22. So last episode, we were searching for a serial killer who was killing in the name of Baal, the Lord of Murder. And we found this serial killer and killed him. And on his body, in his pocket, there was a note that led us to the Kandahalo Tombstones building in Baldur's Gate, to where we found the entrance to a Baalist crypt. So let's have a look. Where the heck are we? That doesn't look good. That which guards, death knight. That which watches, that which lurks. They're showing as yellow. But we're in a ballist crypt right now, so... I don't think I even care if they're in yellow. Let me try something here. I don't know if this is too smart, but I'm going to try it anyways. <laughs> you know what I should do? I should do a AoE attack first. With Gale. Still as stone? I have had the practice. I wonder if I can Misty Step without setting off. Hmm. You only live once. What? I, wait. Shh. Oh man, everybody's coming. Careful, Shadow. Cripe's sake. Immune to necrotic damage. What now? Didn't do too much, did we? What comes now? Mirror image lasts for ten turns. I wonder if I can 
cast it way back here and not be put into combat. These guys look pretty tough. Let me try it. It's gonna really suck if this puts her in combat. Okay, nice. It's gotta go quick now. Oh my god. Are you serious? Oh, just hit the C button and just... Oh, oh that's gonna be annoying. Not the end of the world. It's okay. Alright, little boo. Get in there, buddy. Go help out Minsk. Wonder if I should do another fireball. Or maybe even. Maybe even a cloud of daggers. I can get it just right there. Oh, yeah. Let's try it. Nice. Probably back up with Gal. Lock these guys in here. Oh, that was deadly. The Lupine Slash. What'd you say to me? Bucko? Or who's got the lowest HP? 47? So let's go after this guy first. I think I can get this attack off without doing an opportunity attack. I hit the cloud of daggers though, damn it. I can't move. No. Ferio. I think that's my favorite spell now. Curriculum of strategy. This feels so good. All right, Minsk or Boo, where are you at, buddy? Yeah, you bite him. Stay focused. You guys are almost dead. Actually, it wasn't too bad. Sixty percent. Hmm. I was going to do Spirit Guardians, but I don't know if I need it now. In the stupid cloud. I can't move. Oh. <laughs> they got Perry. Trying to get out of here.
Nice. Okay. That worked out pretty good. Blackguard Gauntlets. Level 4 Necromancy spell. Inflict wounds. Strider movement. You gain long strider. Don't really need those. I have long strider as a ritual. to feel the breeze between my toes. Back to the road. Target can't be reanimated. Don't see any bodies down here. Okay, the Hall of the Murder Tribunal. That F5. Locked. Not anymore. My God, that doesn't look, uh, that doesn't look too friendly. We have a throne of ball of some sort. Murder Tribunal. Let's see what you're hiding. It's Saravak. Oh my God. It's Saravak. This is the main antagonist from Baldur's Gate 1. We've heard hints of Saravak throughout our playthrough, but I didn't expect to actually see him. Holy crap. Legendary resistance, plus 10 bonus to your next saving throw. Echo of Emelison. Sendai and Ilsera. When Amalesson's ghost dies, Saravok's attacks will heal him? When Ilicera's ghost dies, Saravak will be permanently hastened and will be unaffected by paralysis, restraints, or any attempts to reduce his movement speed. When Sendai's ghost dies, Saravak will have his armor class increased by six. Okay. Um, I would imagine that there probably is a dialogue cutscene for Saravak here. Oh god, don't go too- don't holy crap. That. And I definitely want to see it, so we're gonna walk up. But there's no way that we don't walk out of here without this turning into combat. Unless I'm able to deceive or something along those lines. Um, let's see. Oh. I can't afford to fail. I wonder if I should take a long rest before this. 
What level is he? He's level 16? <laughs> Thank god. Okay, hold on. We're gonna come back this way. Everybody come on out. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Consider it done. Most excellent. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take a long rest just to get back my spell slots here. I'm missing one level five, one level three. I mean I do have arcane recovery, but Shadow Heart's missing level one, level two. Alright, yeah, we're gonna take a quick long rest. I have plenty of food. I can't believe that that's Saravok. That's insane. I feel like the, the smart play would be just to drop a fireball on his ass. Don't even don't even ask questions, but I'm sure there's probably some great lore. And I definitely want to hear him speak. I'm like shaking right now. I'm so excited to go back there. All right, let's just go ahead and take a rest. Do I want Minsk, Shadowheart, and Gale? Yeah, sure, why not? That seems fine. Okay. Here we go. Let's send up Wolf. We'll take everybody else. Maybe try to stay together. Hopefully this doesn't trigger or something. All right, Ursa, you ready? Let's stand up. Walk down with no fear. God. No, never mind. You gaze upon murder's progeny, child. His most ill-trusted zealots. His faithful departed. Prodigal servants. Each returns to do his bidding eternally. This man is known to all Baldurians, and his presence sparks dread in the pit of your stomach. Before you is Saravok Anchev. A bar list who almost brought Baldur's Gate to ruin a century ago. Devella was right. Not just an imitator, but Saravok himself. This is the court of the Dread Lord's Tribunal. I am its custodian. Here come those who seek to transcend. Aspirants of his most profane order. The would-be unholy assassins of Baal. Man, an, an evil playthrough is going to be so much fun. I want to become an unholy assassin. What must I do? Saravak, how are you still alive? A long while ago, my wretched sibling bought me back. The fairest of Baal spawn. Soul bound me to this husk. Worship death though I do, I refused it. I roamed the coast, gathering those who still held Baal in their black hearts. The cult survived, festering beneath the city, with me as the gate's everlasting poison. But no more. For poison is too slow a death. Now is the time for slaughter. With these killings, the glory of the Balis has risen beyond what we dreamed possible during those dark days. But the worship of my lord is led by another now. My what? granddaughter, Arin. The youngest unholy assassin ever to follow in Baal's bloody trail and his 
chosen. Orin is his granddaughter. That's a response to Orin is your granddaughter. My very blood. And by extension, his. Baal has never had a more gifted prodigy. Orin's gift surpassed even her mother's. Her mother knew this, and she could not bear it. When Arryn was but seven years old, she tried to smother the child as an offering to our Lord. I heard the screams. I ran to help, but feared for the child's life. But the cries were not Arryn's. It was her mother's blood that soaked the sheets. Arryn had cut off the very hand that tried to end her and made a plaything of it. And as she toyed with her dead mother's hand, a deep quiver rose up through her throat. The Lord of Murder speaking through the child. Lay not a finger on this child, he said, nor let any other, for this child will serve me with unholy ardor. Protect her in my name. One messed up family. <laughs> Did you know that your daughter was planning to kill Orin? I knew of my daughter's ambitions, but not the lengths to which she'd go. She hungered for Baal's favor more than anyone I'd ever known. But her daughter, Arryn, hungered even more. My lord made his choice. I abided by his words. But Arryn is not the subject of our judgment here today. You wish to become an unholy assassin of Baal. So, approach and be judged. What does this judgment involve exactly, Saravak? There is no better mirror in which to see the true nature of a killer than his victim. You took their hands from them. Now, I will clutch one of their souls from the abyss that they may show Baal who you are. Oh, great. Here we go. I have no interest in being judged by Ball. <laughs> this is where you reveal yourself. You have been judged. You have been found wanting. Unworthy. You will make a most beautiful offering to the lord of murder I will not tolerate oh man oh man oh man okay sanctuary too are you serious oh god okay all right, so the problem is if, I, if we kill these ghosts, Saravak gets buffed. He dies permanently hastened. This one's real bad. If this ghost dies, Saravak's attack, Saravak's attacks will heal him for two to 24 damage.
Okay. Oh, this is actually perfect. It looks like I can sneak Minsk, Minsk down right now. Lies? He dreams of evil's doom. Oh, Boo, are you hiding? There you go. Climb that ladder, Boo. Oh, man, I don't know about this. Wonder if Minsk will go through that. I don't even know what I'm gonna do when I get over there, because like do we kill Saravak or do we kill the ghosts? I think I have to go after Saravak. We got sanctuary right now, can't even do anything about it. Worth a try. All right, time to get Minsk involved. Here we go. Um. Oh, look at this. I can actually... I didn't even mean to do that. But that was a fantastic play. Using Fog Cloud allows me to sneak Minsk up behind Seraphok now. Just stick your head in that wasn't even the reason why I used it, but that's great. Can't do anything, though, because you got Sanctuary active on him. Hold on. Is one of these... Okay, so concentrating on haste. Warding bond. Concentration slow. Okay. Maybe it is a good idea to attack them, at least to try to break their concentration. I can actually hit him right now. Okay, let's see if we can break that concentration. Ninety-nine percent. Oh, I could actually get right in the middle here. Oh man, did I even did thirteen damage? I think the haste is what scares me the most right now. You know what's really good for concentration? Is that sleet, sleet storm spell. Do I even have it? Ice storm. Counter spell. No, I don't know if it's a wizard spell or if it's just a druid spell. That would have been really good right there. But actually, let's go ahead and... Let's do Ice Storm. I'm going to get rid of Thunder Wave. Problem is, Minsk is right there too. Can I get him away? Yes, I can. Perfect. Die in silence, mm. Do everything I can to keep these witches just held down. Target's out of sight. Oh, dang. Thought I could do it on an area. Well, Saravak can still take damage from AoE spells. Oh, also this one too. What? Wait, hold on. Alright, I'm gonna move Gal back up. I'm trying to think of a good AoE for these this area right now here without killing them. Take a look at my scrolls. Dominate person, hold monster, flesh to stone. 
Color Spray, Cone of Cold. Probably not worth it, but I made my decision and we will stick with it now. All right, Shadow Heart, I think I'm actually going to, I wonder if I did mirror image up here, if I would be put into the battle, like, um, not sure. Let's move a little bit closer with her because we're going to do Spirit Guardians, I think. Or I could stay up top and just rain down Guiding Bolts on Saravok. Okay, I'll tell you what we're going to do. I just go to Saravak. See if we can bring him back into the Guardian of Faith. Command. Yeah, we're going to counter that. Damn warding bond. This fight is crazy. I don't even know what to do right now. What if I could put these creatures to sleep? That would actually be super awesome. Nice. All right, Gal. Don't want to hit that one. Let me get some shots off on Saravok. Or actually, maybe we could put another one to sleep. I have a potion of sleep. What about dominate person? Would that work? Target must be humanoid. Can't target the undead. Okay. Okay. Stupid warding bond. Oh, this character's already up. Oh, this is crazy. Oh. I think I'm gonna have to kill this ghost. And then Servox gonna be healing himself for two to twenty-four every time he attacks. 
Betcha the dude probably has multi-attack or extra attack. Come on, Guardian of Faith, we need you. Awesome. What if I could banish one of these? I don't have that prepared right now. from good and evil's concentration and we're chipping away at his health so slowly right now it's that warding bond you know what it's time Yes, we broke concentration. That was awesome. All right, Gal, give me your best shot here, my man. Not too bad with warding bonds. Lost condition warding bond. Does that mean? Uh oh. Okay, it means that the <laughs> that one ghost died. Okay. Well. See how that works out. I feel like the one that I really don't want to kill is the one that gives Gale, or not Gale, Saravak the plus six to armor class. Nice. Oh, that is clutch right there. I'm gonna put Boo right in the face of, of this one right here. Do a quick little bite. Your blood oh, that's not good. Sit F5. <laughs> what was that? That was a rage. Deathbringer's legacy is able to use Deathbringer Assault until the end of his next turn. Oh my god. 5d10? Okay, that's a problem. That's a major problem. A major, major problem. We need to try to get this guy prone or something. This could be real ugly. Okay, I like that. Just gotta make sure we don't deal more damage to her. She's about to die, so let me come over this way. Oh man, I can only cast that once per short rest. Kick it. 
we got goodness. yes minsk yes butt kick for goodness oh man i love it let's go music is so epic too okay it's almost saravox turn a little bit nervous about that I don't think the sheep is gonna attack me if I move with Boo, is it? I don't know. Skip to his turn. Wow. That was five attacks at 5d10 each. Minsk is almost dead right now and he only took one or two of those. I've never used the earth elemental before. Oh, that's pretty cool. Larian did a great job on the spells. Perfect. This is actually a really good use of mage armor right here because you can just keep whacking at this character making them do concentration saves not worried about damage at all but trying to end concentration on that slow spell on that opponent okay come on we just need a couple good rolls here let's go not it it's not it what happened to spirit guardians Thirty-five HP. Oh, we do have banishment. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, Seravak has no help anymore. Oh wait, this one just came back. All right, let's go, baby. Come on. Not over yet. It's not over yet. Come on, Minsk. Just killed Saravak with a weapon skill tenacity after a miss. That is a hell of a killing blow. Holy crap. All right, we still got to kill these two echoes. Oh, there goes one. There's just the banished creature now. And I think what we can do is just get everybody close. And then just end concentration with shadow. Still breathing. See ya. was a really really fun fight that might be my favorite combat encounter so far in the entire game all right we got some looting to do justice saravak is dead by our hands we should speak to his holyphant captive before heading to the temple of ball The 
Hollyphant around here somewhere? The Sword of Chaos. Holy crap. I'm finally going to be upgrading my sword on my character. 2d6 plus 7 slashing and necrotic damage. Weapon enchantment plus 2. On a hit, regain 1 to 6 hit points. On a hit, just a regular hit. Wow. Saravox Horned Helmet. You gain dark vision, the range of up to 10 feet or 50 feet if you already have it. Nice. The number you need to roll a critical hit while attacking is reduced by one. You can't be frightened and cannot be afflicted with other emotion altering conditions. Constitution saving throws plus one. Amulet of Ball. On a hit, inflict bleeding upon targets that have maximum hit points. We have a key. Then a map to the Ball Temple. Use a round street hatch to enter the city sewers. Proceed northwest to find your way into the undercity ruins. Blood the skull to pass the door. Oh. So that's how you can open up that door too. We already opened up that door in a previous episode. Follow the trail of murder to the Ball Temple door. Praise Ball. Damn man. Getting updates left and right. We killed Justice Saravak and did not become unholy assassins. We now know how to gain access to the Temple of Baal, but Orin won't be happy that we dismantled the murder tribunal. We must reach the temple and rescue her victim before she learns this. We gotta save Lazel. Okay, well, my character's already wearing Ketherick Thorm chest armor. Might as well put on a might as well put on a helmet of Saravak now. Damn, there it is. That is crazy. Then we'll give Minsk. We'll give Minsk the other helm. The Horns of the Berserker, you gain a plus two bonus to attack rolls when attacking creatures that already have taken damage. It's a really good helm too. Yeah, no, they both look like Saravak. And then let's switch my two-handed sword. So happy that he dropped a weapon for my main character. The Sword of Chaos. Damn, man. I'm going to be one of the scariest looking, nice, kind-hearted characters in this game. <laughs> that is so sick. Yep, it feels right in my hands. Alright, I guess we don't loot the witches. I don't see anything here. Um, we definitely got to sit really quickly in Saravak's throne. Of course. Take it all in. Okay. To do that, you hit F10 if you guys want to know how to hide the interface. Okay, let's find this Hollyphant captive. I wonder if it's Valeria. Saravox prison. Got a keychain right here. Try to speak with the dead. This guy is decapitated. There's no head. Does not respond. Probably check these cells too, just in case there's like a passive perception check or something like that.
Saravox pajamas. Here in our log, the blood requisitions. The corpse wealth of our sacrifices taken from their dead hands. Where's the Hollyphant? Let's get going. <laughs> My character in Minsk. We look so funny right now, but badass at the same time. Alright, what now? Just as Saravak is dead, we should speak to his Halifant captive before heading to the Temple of Baal. What is this? Mambu. Oh, there's the Halifant. It is Valeria. Citizen, thank the gods you're here. My wrinkles are starting to chafe. As an officer of the law, I demand you free me at once. Get here and free me at once. Valeria's kind of rude. Thanks for freeing me so quickly. No idea what those Baalist Burks had planned with me, but those chains were starting to chafe. Though I do wish you'd figured this all out before I... Uh, put the blame for Father Logan's murder on that poor refugee. Well, at least it's over now. How did you end up here? After our chat at Charesse's caress, I thought it best to polish off the bottle I'd started. I started coming over all woozy. My joints stiffened up quicker than a brothel browser's loins. Paralyzed. My vision went black. When I woke up, I was in chains. Overall, a terrible ordeal. One deserving of a drink. I bid you good day, but it's been royally shite all round. Are you sure we're finished? You might not be finished. I am. It's plain to see that I'm well out of my depth here. But you... Well, you gave these reprobates a proper seeing to. You clearly have what I don't. Courage. Insight. Heroism. The city needs you. I overheard these pigs talking. There's a Baal temple deep within the old undercity that the cult is using. A century ago, it was destroyed by a group of heroic sorts. Let's hope history repeats itself, eh? The wrinkled orb is correct. Boo remembers the stench of the temple still. Very good. Now, let's talk and find that temple. <laughs> Lucky for us, we already know where the temple is because we explored the sewers a few episodes ago. I do have a fast travel point. take a long rest before we go down there that's for sure after that battle surprisingly I still have a decent amount of spell slots left actually but my magic not too bad but if we're going into an actual temple of ball it's probably best to be fully rested Valeria's hookah and Valeria's spare pipe Okay, let's head out. Can't fast travel. Have a lot on my mind. Um, in this area. Well, in it. Breathe deep and move. Oh, 
such an epic adventuring party. I really want to take Jahira with me when we go into the Temple of Baal because this is a temple that Jahira and Minsk have been to in the previous Baldur's Gate games. But I'm really enjoying having Shadowheart and Gale in my group too, a cleric and a wizard, two of the most useful classes. from me to judge Gale for playing coy with Mistra, but I will not be cleaning up whatever mess she makes of him for it. You have a history with Saravak. Nothing so grand. He was just another broken little ball spawn who tried to clamber to glory over the corpses of others. There was a time when he might have made more of himself. He was certainly given the chance after we threw him down. But he slunk back into his father's shadow instead. <laughs> there is nothing more to say of him. This crown seems too powerful and dangerous an object for mere mortals to possess. Too dangerous even for Mistra. But I would sooner trust it with a god than with Gale. Interesting. Lady of Sorrows guide us. Did you want something? I want to talk about all that's happened to us. Fine. What's on your mind? How am I holding up in your estimation? How are you holding up? Don't be so modest. I can't remember the last time I met someone like you. Perhaps I never did. And never will again. That was cute, Shadow. Thanks. Made me feel all fuzzy inside. Not talking to you, Mizora. Leave me alone. Fate, dost thou require a new ally? No, I do not, Withers. Wow. So that was Mistra. Pretty spectacular stuff. But I think Gail was right not to agree to do her bidding, no questions asked. I respect the gods. But they don't always understand what they're asking of us. Maybe immortality makes it hard to know what it's like to be one of us piggies. Proud of Gale, though. It takes some man to hold his own in front of the Divine. So the companions are commenting on what happened last episode with Gale when he met with Mistra. How can I help? So, Gale's hedging his bets with Mistra? I can't say I blame him. Who'd want to hold a power like the Crown of Carsus in their hands just to hand it to someone else? I know what my decision would be, but we're all different, of course. I'm so surprised that I still have Astarion around. I thought he would have left my group for sure, or would have been killed or something like that, but his story ended up turning out to be one of my faves. I can't wait to do another run and actually let him take in all the power that he can get. No time to rest. Okay, let's uh, head to the Temple of Baal. I think we're good in here. I'm just going to keep the same party comp. Off we go. I should have a fast travel point to the Undercity Ruins. Excuse me, Bereki. This has got to be one of the coolest looking places underneath the surface world in this game.
Damn it, who's looking at it? Oh, look at this. We have some assassins up on the cliffs here. Sent us running last time. Brecky, are you serious? You're going to blow our cover. You got to leave, man. Okay. Non lethal. Had to be done. And actually, while he's down. We'll take his gold. Never a dull moment. Okay, how do I get up to that area? Up here. Clicked on it too early. All right, we got to find a way to take care of these guys. Still breathing, despite everything. You know what? I kind of feel bad. I took all of his gold. That was a little bit. That was hard. That was a little bit harsh. Let's give him, we'll give him five, we'll give him 900 back. There you go, buddy. Okay. Where'd the gold go? I don't even see it on the ground. Oh, it's right here. Here you go, man. All right, let's carry on. I mean, really, you can't be up in an adventuring group's face like that when they're trying to stealth into a temple of Baal, you know what I'm saying? Man, this is so cool. I hope we get to go up in here. I think we're going to be able to. Come on. Look at this. They're marking us right now. Dude, this is crazy. This is crazy. Oh my god. What just happened? What was that mark that they gave us? I don't have any resurrection scrolls. Shadowheart was the one that could resurrect. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, we can't rest right now. Okay, Shadow, you gotta stay back here for a second. 
We're gonna let Gale handle this by himself. Like a total badass. He did not like that these guys killed Shadowheart. Not one bit. Not worried about it. Not at all. Okay, we might need backup now. Right there, Shadow. Actually, you can come with us. You know what we do have? That new spell. Heal. God, that is a massive heal right there. That's uh oh, we're marked again. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. As part of the challenge to enter the temple, the affected entity has become the target of a chanting cultist, the Far Slayer, who can cast Ball's Power Word Kill. Once its profane ritual ends, exiting the Far Slayer's chanting range of 183 feet makes you invulnerable to the effect. Slaying the Far Slayer stops the ritual and wins the conflict. I bet it is a talking. That's not good. I have one turn to get away right now. Okay, nice. Keeping my head down. Well, this is interesting. What? I... Wait. Shh. Okay, the ritual's done. A rough tempest I will raise. guy's still unstoppable for five. I wonder if magic missile would take care of unstoppable in one round. The answer to that is yes. Oh, great. Gale is marked now. Oh man. Oh no, 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 no. I don't fancy their chances. 
No! Oh my god, this guy is crazy! Oh, this is crazy. Okay. Let's see if we can sneak in here without getting that mark on ourselves. Perception failed. God, man. Oh, dude, no way. Okay, these guys didn't cast the, uh, the ritual on us. enough movement. Hmm, what do we want to do here? What do we want to do? That'd be so funny to cast Guardian of Faith up there. Not enough room, though. I don't know if it's smart to teleport up there right now, but after we do mirror image, maybe. Alright, Mince, come on, baby. Can you get up there? Oh, yes, you can, Misty Step. And how would you get up there if you didn't have? Huh. Shadow teleportation costs an action. We'll just stay down. I think Minsk has this handled. Let's do... We don't even need Hunter's Mark right now. Let's do... Okay. And there we go. Side and hamster at hand. Oh, wow, look at this. Camaraderie, adventure, violence. Are we going to so go back? And sure as hunting hamsters. This is so much fun when you've never played the content before and everything. You just have no idea what's going to happen. Damn, that's a hell of a jump right there. Oh, nice. Wolf made it up. Okay, so let's take Wolf. Oh, Shadow did... Oh, no, the bear did. Okay. Let's sneak up here. Let's see if we can get down the back way. Shadow Heart can stay down here. Gotta be some assassins in here, right? You would think. Great. 
Where's that damn wizard when you need him? Man, this is cr this is crazy. This is crazy. Are you serious? Okay. We got to bring Shadow Heart in to save the day. These guys are casting all sorts of spells over there because they surprised Wolf and Minsk. Once they're done, I'll figure out what I'm going to do here. Okay, so we can come down. Let's see. Oh, it looks like you can actually get from here to over there. Alright, let me see if I have a potion of fly. I do have that shadow teleport. Hold on. Let's see how far I can actually make it. Wonder if I can make it up to the top without having to move into that area? Hard to tell with the camera. Might be able to actually. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. This is gonna be risky. But we're gonna do it because our friends need us to we'll come all the way back here i'm gonna lose a little bit of time on this but that's okay if i do this quickly we should be fine all right shadow back down in stealth let's go come on come on come on come on come on we've got eight turns left on <laughs> oh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Would like if she wasn't next to the edge, though. Okay. Alright, Minsk, what do you got? You're dazed right now, my man? Got a monk. Very nice. Hey, Wolf, honestly, can you jump up there, my friend? Don't think he can. Too high. Question is, how do you get up there? Probably from over here. Start moving that way. Oh, I didn't see the opportunity attack right there. Okay, fair enough. Okay, ran out of mirror image. That guy just shot us three times. That's okay. Oh, damn it. See ya. 
Bone Spike Gloves. Your attacks ignore resistance to slashing, piercing, and bludgeoning damage. Wow. These are some great gloves to hold on to when you fight certain enemies that have that physical damage resistance. And there's been quite a few. And actually, what does Minsk have on right now? Where it gains advantage on melee attack rolls while surrounded by two or more foes. I'll leave that on. I'm not gonna do Hunter's Mark, I'll tell you why. Oh, I don't have a bonus action left, never mind. I was gonna try pushing him off. Alright, Mr. Bear. If I should jump from up here. Now nah, we'll go this way. We gotta help Shadow. Gotta be careful with that. Who breaks the hearts? Minch breaks the bones. And I didn't realize I should have missed the step before I used Dash. <laughs> no, we're not close enough, seriously. Damn slowed condition. Oh wow. on god flesh you are but a tiny crumb my faith will protect me I guess we'll jump, take the damage. The Imagine a grizzly bear coming around the corner like that. Despite everything. Oh, you're lucky, brother. You're lucky I can't reach you. You are lucky. You have dimension door. Finally see this guy. There we go. Nice. Man, this has been so much fun so far. Undercity ruins. Okay. A little chaotic. And a lot of unexpected things happening. But it's just been so much fun trying to... 
figure out how to get out of these situations. Never a dull moment. Okay, back to trying to save Gale. We gotta kill this stupid thing. Like, wherever we go, there's gonna be those assassins. And my party's always gonna fail their perception checks. I'm afraid to come down this way. Because I think we're going to be marked, like, right away. Shadow doesn't have her shadow teleport anymore. Do have invisibility, though? Actually, that would be huge. Okay, hold on. Okay, let's do that. Better tread carefully. I'm a little bit nervous to go through here and take a right, because... I feel like we're going to encounter some more assassins. We also might encounter assassins right here, too, actually. Alright. Probably like an archer up here or something like that. Maybe we should go in. Okay, come here. Come here, wolf. Godspeed, brother. You coming down, my man? Wonder if I can jump him. Ooh, look at that. Could move him all the way over here, get some high ground, but I feel like I don't want him to end up in a battle with like five assassins. Go really, really slow. have a ton of invisibility left. I'm just gonna leave Wolf right there. Oh man. Yep, there's definitely... Alright, come this way, buddy. Another perception check failed. Oh, we made it out here. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. Are you gonna mark me? Is he gonna mark me? Oh, damn, what the hell?
Okay, three damage. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, now we got three assassins to deal with. <laughs> oh man, where are they? Okay, they're all up there. All right, we still got Shadowheart over here though. So let me just see what they do on their turn. Never a dull moment. Don't want them raining arrows down on me, so let's I think we might be okay right here. Let's work on this guy now. Oh wait. Okay. Well that was freaky. Oh man, this place is freaking me out. This is just downright crazy. Ursa. Come here, girl. Let's go ahead and get Gal up before we do anything else. Oh yeah, Gale's actually dead right now. We need to revivify. Where is his body? Right there, okay. Alright, Shadow. We need your help. Yeah, this entire area right here is just so well designed from the visuals to the enemies everything about it Okay, we got a full party once again. We've saved me. I cannot take much more. Come on, gal. How do I get down? Well, while we're up here, we might as well check to see if there's anything. Now that it seems like all the assassins have gone away. Incredible. Okay, we got the crew back together. I did not snore. It was a battle trance. We might be looking at another long rest here. Because we are heading into the Temple of Baal. Where we will be probably confronting Orin. I don't think Orin is someone that we want to mess with. Need to keep going. Unless we're ready. Damn, man, Ball is such a brutal, evil, dark god. With ease.
Scroll of Disintegrate. That will come in handy. What's next? Just wanted to check in there. Okay, there's nothing in there. Have to keep pushing. Yeah, okay, let's go back over here and just check the upper area. Look at this. Nice, superior healing potion. Deeper into the temple we go. Now time to rest. Breathe deep and move. Oh my god. Okay, let's take a long rest while we can. Here we go. I looked for a few bodies back here, but those bodies are now gone. So I have nothing to animate. The Lord of Murder shall perish. Waiting with bated breath. But in his doom, he shall spawn a score of mortal progeny. Oh my gosh, this is references to Baldur's Gate 1. These are references, not this. What I'm worried about here is we're going to get into a bunch of fights before we actually reach Orin. And where do we even go? I had to guess Orin is probably here. But we have the option of going down this back way. Nice and slow, guys. Anything of use? Doesn't look like anybody else is down here. 
Okay, I take that back. What to do? Have to keep going. Oh, there's a bunch of rats down here. Oh my god. And a waypoint. I'm assuming that these rats are going to attack. Only one way to find out, though. Clean you, rats. They swarm when an elder brain is near. We must be close to its height. Turn back. We must have all the nether stones before we approach the brain. Okay. What did I just stumble upon? Oh my gosh, we can take the skiff right there. I think we just came across the waypoint that we'll be using when we're ready to finally confront the Elder Brain. So like one of the last quests of the entire game. Oh, that's going to be... That's going to be interesting. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Great. <laughs> I got to get them to group up a little bit. I wonder if I put grease on that. If I threw grease right here, if they would all just slip. Oh man. <laughs> Hold your ground, Ursa. Hold your ground. Okay, perfect. Confused right now. So is my bear. Okay. <laughs> I think we did it. A couple left. I'm not going to waste a weapon action. <laughs> oh, we're attacking each other. Actually, still like there's three of them still alive. Come on, game, you want to give it to me? I know you do. Something's exploding. Gotta get out of there.
Okay, I'm happy we came over here, though. We now have that waypoint, and we know where we gotta go. When we're ready. Or what I'm assuming is the final part of the game. On my way. Wonder if we could get over from over here. Still got Boo with us? Where's little Boo? Come on, Boo. Now you got little legs. Alright, let's do a manual save. Let's call this Orin. Bomb. Oh, we have some bodies for Gale. Ghouls. Okay, very nice. 33 HP each, and we could also do create undead, or I could keep my globe of invulnerability. I feel like we might need that more than a zombie in this upcoming fight. So I'm gonna keep that on. So saith the wise Alondo. Clown severed head. Oh my gosh, is that for that quest that we picked up back at the circus? Wait, I know this head. <laughs> it belongs to Dribbles the Clown. Oh my god. Search around for his other parts. Now we have the Ballist Amulet in the Temple of Balls location. We can finally face Orin. Okay. I don't know if the zombies can hide. No, they can't. So we're gonna separate them a little bit. We have a little bit of high ground here. I wonder if I should leave Gao up here. Oh, wow. Okay, hold on. Let's go check this out.
this has got to be it start thinking about where we want to be we have a waypoint down here I feel like that means we can go down here without getting into combat okay come on zombies let's go This looks like a place where I'd want to put a wizard and his zombies. this a lot up here then we can even leave either one zombie or two zombies protect him if this is where the battle is going to go down maybe we end up going through that door Knees are not made for all this bending. <laughs> Man, like what is this over here? This is this is so crazy, this undercity. Gotta be one of the coolest areas in all of gaming. Definitely CRPGs, that's for sure. Okay. Oh, Off we go. Got Sniper Gal up top. Okay, now we can't fast travel anymore. Interesting, this entire area over here is... Not inside this red mist. Overly cautious here. When you're dealing with Orin, can you ever be overly cautious? But there's got to be a significance to all of this terrain over here and all of this environment. I think this is just another way down. Yeah, it is. Okay. All right. Let's go across the bridge.
stone seals this chamber against the world. This is a foul place. Better bear it. Already Boo is bristling, and not from the cold. The Baal amulet trembles in frightened awe. Okay, let's examine the door. I don't think we have to, but let's see what that reveals. Murder. Bloody murder. Who else but Baal would these symbols honor? Press the amulet against the door. Will you return once you cross this threshold? Dude, how big is this Undercity? This is crazy. As the city grows weak. Can't tell who that is down there. We can't really get in here. Let me use invisibility. What am I to do? Light on my feet. Whoa, my bear just came right in. These guys are yellow right now, so. Wow. Would savor such destruction. Wonder if I should just try speaking with them. Or do we just assassinate our way in here? Or we could sneak, actually. You know what? Let's do this. What path lies before me? I have time. God, is that Lazel? Oh, we broke him. A oh, it's Lazel. Made a right mess of his hand. Peeled the skin from it myself. An Orin. I dropped him outside the fort. Let Gortash see what happens to his nasty little spies. You gotta be kidding me. Blazel knocked out, still alive. Oh, it'd be awesome if I could pick up her body and put it in my inventory. It won't let me, though. Okay. This is going to be a hell of a battle. going to be a hell of a battle. I don't know where I want to start it. I'm not going to lie, I did just try to see if I could push Orin off the cliff right here, but she's a little bit short here. Okay. Alright, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. We're going to put Wolf 
Hmm, if I could get him in a place where he could stay invisible for a few rounds while I walk the rest of the party in. That could be super useful. Problem is this battleground is so big. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna bring him back. We're gonna stay together. begun. Reminds me of a star I'm with Kazador. It's gonna stay together, man. Truly, Lady Orin's kills are something to behold. Orin is a quick jam, a small slice and... Can't miss out on these good cutscenes. I hear footsteps trip trapping on the murder lord's stones. It refused the murder lord's command and comes crawling into his sanctum with the tyrant unpoped. I know what you did. Spilled my grandfather's crimson. Was mine. He showed me how to slice and slit. He guides my dagger still. Oh, did it think it could protect? Did it think it could save? Only the blades can offer salvation. We can deceive her. Interesting. Gortash is dead. I left him rotting on the roof of his fortress. 5% chance. Hmm. We'll use one inspiration point, but for 5% chance, I don't know. Okay, we're done. It was worth a try. Liar! Liar! He still sucks air in his rock-rotten fortress. <laughs> you disobeyed the murder lord. He will be compensated. No. What? Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> Not good enough. No gristle, no meat. Poor clay for sculpting an atrocity. Disgusting creature. You'll pay for what you did here. I was only wetting the blades. Now it is your turn on the slab. Your turn to watch the veins split and the bones break. Oh, your murder should have been exquisite. A crypt born effigy to great balls bleeding dawn. And now it will be nothing. Come to me, Father. Set my flesh to your unholy purpose! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, so much just happened. Lazel's dead. Oh. God, man. All right. Now is not the time to weep. Freaking Slayer, man. Insane. Infected entity has embraced its savage compulsions, allowing it to assume its slayer form. Unstoppable for seven. In BG1, your character can turn into the slayer for a few moments. All right. Luckily, Gale is... Oh, interesting. These guys aren't actually fighting. Wonder if I can hold on. Let me hide him first. Man, like all I can think about is Lazel, just I can't believe it. I wonder if we can resurrect her after, probably not. But it is what it is. Orin is a nasty, nasty person. It just makes this fight all the more important and meaningful for me to kill her. All right, so Unstoppable 7, if we do a magic missile, we could take care of Unstoppable right away. I'd be using up a level... Hmm. I think it's worth it. Okay. Here we go. I'm not sure if I should go after the Slayer or go after Orin first. Doesn't have that much HP, actually. These guys are ca casting Sanctuary. Okay. Look at Larian's take on the Slayer form. That's incredible. When she first transformed, I wasn't sure if it was the Slayer or not. Okay, let's go. We got this. I'm gonna take it slow with her. So I'm gonna come in with Spirit Guardians. Okay. Slow on four targets. Yeah. Close level three spell. Nice. Thank God he didn't upcast it. Guess we're gonna go after Orin first. That's the strat right now. My hamster, he thirsts for justice. Drink deep, boy.
and back him up a little bit just in case one of these ball cultists use a spell that pulls Gal. Tells me it's not over <laughs> after the Slayer form has been defeated. Oh God, Boon of Unstoppable again. Okay. to save Orin's victim from her clutches. We might, I mean, Orin might be defeated right now. I'm not sure. I don't think it's going to be that easy, though. You guys all have Sanctuary. dump too many spell slots. I don't know if we have to kill the guys that have Sanctuary active. Oh, I think they're going to attack here in a second. Sanctuary. Forgot about Mr. Ursa. Magic Missile works so good on that unstoppable condition.
Villain Sanctuary. Oh, dang, I'm going to take an opportunity attack here. <laughs> Just kidding. Shouldn't have wasted my bonus action. I'm not used to dual wielding. But if you only need a little bit of damage, you might as well just do an offhand strike instead of auto doing your main and your offhand because that uses up your action and your bonus action. Okay, we have one assassin left. The Reaper of Ball. Nice. Still can't attack them though. Not yet. Can't harm them. Stalker of Gehenna's wastes. Take our zeal. Take our blood. Hey, now his sanctuary is gone. Now it's time for him to die. survived to witness your triumph. All life within was extinguished by Orin's blades. But you still live. You have robbed another god of his chosen. Mourn your fallen ally and swear her death will not be in vain. Glint of light on something in the blood catches your eye. Another stone. Just one chosen remains. Let's endeavor to make that none, shall we? Find Gortash and take his nether stone. Lazel's actually dead. This can be a little bit of a... I don't want to say turning point because my character was already leaning towards that, but perhaps my character now wants to fight for Lazel and honor her death and help out El Orpheus. And defy Vlacketh. I think that's what we're going to go for now. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. An unnatural death. There's no coming back from that. Okay, let's do some looting. We now have a second nether stone. I don't plan on bringing it to Gortash. Oh, 
feel that one later. At this point, no already can relished break tormenting this poor soul. It. We must seize the third stone before it breaks free. is the room where Orin left. We took down Orin really fast. Aravok was a much harder fight, at least for my party comp. You don't use a spell like Magic Missile, though. It would take potentially seven actions to get that unstoppable condition off of her. Orin's mother. Oh my god. Ooh, this is sick. I don't mean that in like the cool sick way. This is disgusting. Such a dark, dark story. Invasion plans for Baldur's Gate and also Eltergard. Eltergard is the nation. That is east of Baldur's Gate. Okay. Well, I think this is going to be a good stopping point for this episode. This was a heart-wrenching one. But it was also one of the most fun sessions that I've had up to this point. I think Larian did a phenomenal job on the Temple of Baal and the characters down here. I'm just having such a good time. So I'm going to go mourn Lazelle's death. I'll catch you all on the next one.